Good morning, guys. So today is the day of my surgery. Very excited. Not nervous yet. Basically, my surgery is at 4 in the afternoon. Um, yeah, so we're leaving here maybe like at 10 because it takes like an hour and a half to get over there. So like what? That's going to be like 12. I do have to take a COVID test beforehand. Um, it's in the same building, so uh, we're going to do that like at 1 maybe when we get there. So... And these next couple of clips will most likely be uh, us like driving there um, or being in the clinica or afterwards. I'm gonna have my mom film, you know, like right when I get out. I'm gonna be updating you guys um, once I get home, like what I do to clean it, uh, how I'm feeling, how I'm looking. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know, pretty excited, but I will see you guys in the next couple of clips. sure I don't die um they're gonna have me stay in this little room so I'll give you guys a little look After I get out, my mom can't be with me, so I'm like actually alone alone. So I'm gonna film after I get out. Hopefully, I have energy. So I'll see you guys. Bye. Hey guys, sorry if you're not comfortable with blood, but there's a lot of blood going on. Um, they have to change my drip pad out. Um, I just had my first like meal of the day. It's, what time is it? It is 3.24 in the morning. Um, I, they gave me a caldo de pollo, um, crackers, jello, and then fruta. So I had that and it was delicious. Obviously it was a crime because I couldn't taste it. But yeah guys, I feel really, I feel fine. Um, there's not really any pain going. It's kind of more of like discomfort in my nostrils um, and then my throat. But I'm gonna try to get some sleep. Hopefully I can get some type of sleep. Now that I ate, I feel so much better. All right guys, so it is morning time now. Um, I wanna say it's like eight o'clock. Yeah, it's 8.32. So it's 8.32 in the morning. Um, I'm just getting breakfast. They came in to take um, my vitals and then put in some more medication just for the pain. I'm not really feeling any pain at all. Maybe it's because of the medication, I'm not sure but I feel really fine. Um, my nose doesn't hurt. The only thing I kind of feel is like, I, the best way I can describe it is like, you know, like when you jump into a pool or like a body of water and like water shoots up your nose, that's kind of what it feels like. It feels like it's kind of like a tingly sensation, but other than that, I'm perfectly fine. Um, I'm not tired. I woke up around, I couldn't sleep. Um, I woke up around, I woke up around Six o'clock, I believe, and I fell asleep like at 4:45, comfortably. Um, so yeah, let me guys, let me show you guys my breakfast. Gotta turn the camera here. So again, we have Jello. We have a tea de manzanilla. Well, I guess it's in there. We have bread. Hello. 
It looks like it's just huevos con espinaca, so um, eggs with spinach, I believe. Yep. I should be leaving in a couple hours. Hours? Just kidding, minutes. Uh, I think all they have to do is just go have me like, go upstairs, talk to the doctor, things like that. Talk to the doctor, and then um, he's just gonna, I think he's, oh, he's gonna put another like drip pad on me. But yeah, other than that, I should be good to go home. Hey guys, just wanted to do a little update. So I did shower. I took a bath. Um, I think that was better, I guess, for me, because, uh, I don't know, I just felt like a bath would be better. Um, obviously can't get my cast wet, so this is the thing, this is the cast I have on here. I honestly feel like the bruising, like this might just be the only bruising that I'm getting, just because it is already turning, like, yellow, um, and obviously when you bruise, you know, it turns, like, a purple, greenish color, then it turns yellow. So, sorry if you don't want to be that close, but... Um, I've been taking pain meds every, like, six to eight hours. Um, the pain meds that they gave me, honestly, though, are trash. Um, it's 250 milligrams, which is nothing. I just... I've been really drowsy all day because uh, of the anesthesia. Um, but, yeah, I'm hoping, again, this bruising kind of starts going away um other than that i'm like super swollen like the swelling is just going down here and i look like a chipmunk without my little bandage on um so yeah i'll catch you guys tomorrow good morning guys um right now it is 5 30 in the morning i can't really sleep I really woke up maybe, I want to say like every other hour, not like every hour probably. Um, I fell asleep initially, like at probably like 8.30. And then every hour, or every honestly like 45 minutes, I'd be waking up after that. Um, <laughs> throat really hurts right now. Um, a lot of it could be because of the tubes that were down my throat, um, or just, you know, the mouth breathing. Um, yeah, I'm about to take all my pain medication right now, um, just because the last time I took it was before I went to bed. Um, so gave me this one, it's called, um, what is it called? Lodixina? Lodi Lodixina? This one is basically uh, disinflammatories uh, for, dis for disinflammation and pain. Um, they gave me this one called Maxiplina. Um, this one was also for the pain, I believe. And um, so I take that, and then and then I have my. Um, well, I just have Tylenol. I take two of these, which is 500. So, um, yeah. And then I take these Arnica, Arnica, I think it's what it's called. Um, Arnica tablets. Uh, these are for just pain relief. It's muscle pain, stiffness, swelling from injuries and bruising. Um, so I do that. And then I have the last one. I take these. Um, I take these bromelain pills, so these ones um, have pineapple enzymes and they support healthy digestion, joint comfort, um, and these are also just basically for the swelling and um, bruising. <coughs> My bruising, I feel, it looks kind of bad right now, um, but I just checked in the mirror and it and honestly looks the same. Um, but yeah. Good morning, everybody. Um, so today is, I want to say, three days post-op. Um, I got my surgery Friday night. 
or no, I guess Thursday night, Friday morning. Um, I'm just super, super swollen again um, when it came to um, bruising. Strangely enough, I did get nothing like literally that's the only bruising I got and maybe like the inside of my eyes I don't know if you guys can really tell but that's where I got the bruising um swelling it did start up here and now it's slowly coming down here my face feels like a ball like and what I have not been doing um is icing which I should be it just the ice feels too like cold for my face and I'm like my face is super sensitive so it feels really cold on my face, but that's one thing I should be doing. Um, I am taking like the pills for the anti-inflammatory um, and like the Arnica, I'm taking that too, just for pain, swelling, or pain, what is it? Joint pain or muscle pain, swelling, bruising, stuff like that. I had pizza yesterday, which is not good. Um, just because again, you can't have a lot of uh, salt you can't have a lot of like greasy foods um, And plus it was hard for me to eat anyways um, I couldn't taste it either. So I don't know why I had it uh, uh, I've been sleeping here on the uh, On a recliner Just because it's so much easier for me instead of a bed um, on the bed. I feel like I Like I get like anxiety just because I guess I'm not like I don't know. It just doesn't I don't like sleeping on the bed. Um, so the first night that I, the first night I did, and uh, Robert actually kicked me in the face. Um, he kicked me like up here, which it didn't hurt, but I was like, okay, I can't be doing this. Like, what if, you know? And I, he actually kicked me twice. He kicked me the first time, and I caught his foot, and that one would have been bad. Um, he he kicked me the second time, but again, he like barely kind of like. Uh, past his foot over like the bridge of my nose and it didn't hurt it just kind of like I was kind of scared um, so yeah I'll keep you guys updated um, like I said the bruising honestly should be gone in the next like three or four days I'm hoping just because again it's already yellowing like right here and on the inside hey guys little update um, I feel good um, I showered a little bit ago, um, and I, there's really not many updates I could do just because I'm not really doing anything, um, other than staying at home and sleeping and watching movies and my phone and the laptop. Um, I, again, I, yeah, I haven't been doing... I went out yesterday like for a walk and everything because I feel like I needed to be outside like I was just inside for too long um, update on the bruising I'm pretty sure it's going away um, I feel like it's just a little bit worse on this side um, it's more purple um, but again the yellow is still there yellow is there as well uh, yeah um, I've been taking my medication every like six to eight hours I really, I only feel like I need it at night. Um, at night is kind of when I get the most irritated. Um, I'm just honestly just waiting until Friday. Um, on Friday they're going to remove the cast. Um, I can't wait to take this off, bro. Like, I'm honestly just like over it at this point. Um, I'm just tired and I want this off and I want to be able to breathe um, and taste food, Jesus Christ. Um, but yeah, not much to update today. Um, I haven't really been doing anything. Alright guys, so I'll uh, keep update. I'm pretty sure it's day four post-op. Yeah, since Saturday would be day one. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Yes, today is day four post-op. Um, it does kind of um, get irritated when I shower just because I do kind of have to like put my head back. And obviously putting your head back is kind of, you know, making this irritated just because you're going like this. Um, but I need to shower. I can't not shower. Uh, I'm hoping tomorrow um, I do wake up a little less swollen. Alright guys, um, I'll update you tomorrow or if anything happens later on, I'll update you guys later on. Bye. Good morning guys. Um, 
little update on my face and how it's looking so far. Um, bruising is going down on this eye. That one's still there, kind of. Um, um, my swelling is going down. Um, it's really in like my my cheeks still, like bottom right here. Um, right now I'm just taking my drugs. Yesterday, um, yesterday my nose was very irritated, um, and I think that's just because I've been like touching it a lot. Um, I've been kind of going like this like to like catch any um you know liquid or anything because i really don't i hardly wore the drip pad yesterday um or when i do wear it like i'll kind of be like moving it around like going like this to it just because um it does get itchy um so today i'm gonna try to not wear it at all um, i did buy these um like a nasal spray um a, a saline nasal solution from Amazon yesterday and I used that. Um, I honestly don't, I don't know if it's doing anything. Um, I bought Afrin as well, which is Afrin is also a nasal spray. Um, I'm not sure, like I said, if it does anything. Supposedly it's supposed to like, just like moisten it. Um, I don't know. I'll update you guys later on uh, if there's anything. Hey guys, so right now she just put in uh, algodon with anesthesia of my nose. Um, they're gonna remove my stitches and then um, remove the cast in just a second. Okay guys, so clearly I got my nose done. Um, I am two weeks post-op as of today actually. Yeah, so I'm two weeks post-op so I'm gonna give you kind of a side view. Um, I should have I'm probably going to post some pictures on uh, what I looked like before. Um, so this is my profile of my left side, which my left side was probably my worst side, just because the bone that I had sticking out was uh, right here. Um, I've always liked my right side of my face, but now I like both sides. Um, so that's me and then when I smile So that's me smiling and then this is my right profile um, So and it's still super swollen right now. It's like very swollen. There's not too much definition to my nose um, It's kind of just going down uh, and there's like you can't there's not any definition right now. It's, it's still again. It's still swollen. Um, they took my cast off last week and that was just like the white thing that I had on right there. Um, and then I had just like tape around it and everything. Um, yeah, they just took the tape off and everything. Uh, they took the cast off. That honestly though. That shit hurting. That was the only thing that hurt throughout this whole procedure. Maybe, I mean, she probably didn't use enough anesthesia um, to numb my nose. So I could feel it a little bit. Uh, so on this side, it was pretty numb. It just, when she was cutting the, um, am I yelling? When she was cutting the, um, the stitches that did, I mean, I could feel it a little bit. Sponsor me white claw. So yeah, when she was cutting the stitches, um, she, 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 again, she put the anesthetic, um, she put like little, um, like algodon, she put, what is it called in English? Cotton balls, cotton pads, whatever, I don't know. She soaks something in anesthetic and she put that up my nose just so, you know, it can be um, numbed for whatever she was doing. So she put that in for maybe like, like five to seven minutes, I want to say. And, um, she took it out afterwards so everything would be you know numb basically um so she took it out and then she started um by removing the stitches first so she was first doing the ones that are like on the nostril area and again those it, it didn't hurt from this side but i can feel it like i can just obviously you can feel like the snipping of the scissors 
like I could feel it but it didn't hurt and like when she was pulling it out like I could barely I could barely feel it like 1 out of 10 pain was like one maybe and then she started to go inside my nose because there was also stitching on the inside of my nose and again those you could you could feel it but it wasn't pain and then she moved to my right side and um i could feel it i could feel everything she saw me like kind of squirming so she's like oh vamos a dejar otro, otro ratito like we're gonna leave it a little longer I'm like please and um so she, she put it up there a little longer and then she took it out and it was a little better. Um, so she again, she started from the nostrils, went, went on the inside. Um, and then, oh, uh, when she took off like the cast and everything and the tape, she kind of like wiped my nose down like with something just to clean it. Beforehand, obviously before the surgery, um, when I would run my hand or run my finger down my nose, you could like, my, fi my finger would go like this so it's going straight, the bump, and then like that. Um, when she was cleaning it, her her finger went straight down. I was like, I, I, I could feel that there was no bump there. And like, I almost like burst into tears. I was like, oh my God, like I, like, I, I did that. I was like, I really did it. And there was no bump and I almost started crying. And then she put tape back on my nose. Um, because your nose is so swollen still, um, they want you to have tape on it, so it's basically like a faja for your nose, um, just so everything stays in place. I did take it off, like the t I, did, I took the tape off Wednesday because I had to go back to work. So I took it off, and that was the first day I finally like seen my nose like with makeup and everything. I was like, <gasps> it looks so pretty. Um, I'm super excited how it came out. Um, my front is, I love how my front looks. Um, yeah this is two weeks post-op i do have another um follow-up appointment uh next friday uh, just so they can make sure everything's you know healing well um and you know that nothing went wrong so i'm probably gonna end the video here um just because there's probably not much to update you afterwards um other than maybe i'll do like a six months or maybe like a year uh, update. So yeah, guys. That was my nose job journey. Um, thank you guys for keeping up with the videos. If you have, thank you. Um, if you haven't, please subscribe. Cause I have a new nose, so why not? <laughs> um, uh, this is kind of, I guess. Let me kind of zoom you guys in just a little bit. So it's again, it's still really swollen, but. Again, I'll give you guys a profile view, so my left, um, front, and then my side, my right side. So, cheers to a new nose, and cheers to 2020 still being a fail. Okay, so I'll see you guys on the next video. Um, Again, I did go to the river this past weekend. I was having so much fun, like just being out and being on the river. Like I, we really needed it. Like it was so much fun. Um, was drunk all three days, you know. What more do you want? I gambled, lost it all. But that's what you go for, right? You gamble to lose, not to win. Yeah. So I'll see you guys on my next video, which don't know what it'll be yet. Um, I have a couple of my cousins who I want to. Um, film with um robert's cousins i kind of want to do obviously like challenges but i have no content in here i need content so yeah guys uh thank you so much for watching again the video um i hope you guys like the result because i love the result um i feel so much happier now that i actually like my appearance so yeah uh thank you guys and i'll catch you on the next video bye